Guys, what's going on? Jeff here bringing you more of Super Monkey Ball Maker. I know that uh, the last few videos of Monkey Ball Maker have been tutorial videos, and that was mostly so that I could uh, encourage more people to make levels. Anyway, we are back with some more gameplay. This is not going to be one of my own levels. Uh, in fact, uh, what we're going to be showing off today uh, is going to be some other people's levels in the community. So, right now, uh, this pack that I'm using right here, this, this ice hook, do my headset, please. Uh, this ISO right here has a fully replaced World 1, uh, I think it's like a few a few levels from World 2, um, and some levels in like World World 4, and I think World 3 as well. Uh, so we're going to start off by, I guess we can just go through, uh, we can just, we can just go through Story Mode World 1 for this video. Why not? Uh, we'll just go through Story Mode World 1, we'll select a new file, we'll name it We'll name it, uh, wait, can I name it? Can I name it something silly? Like, we'll, we'll name it, uh, let's see. Wait, why can't I hit mark? Oh, I can't. Okay, we can, we can do that. Uh, we'll, we'll just, we'll just, nah. I can't, I can't just name it 420. Let's, oh, I know what we can do. Uh, there we go. Name it that. Author mode? I don't want to author anything. Nor do I want to author anything. Anyway, so this is World 1. Uh, these are some of the levels we're going to be showing off. Um, just give you kind of a, a glimpse here. Uh, the names are not replaced currently. Uh, we do have ways to do it, but the names aren't replaced at the moment. So these are the 10 levels I'll show off today. Let's go. We got we got a replacement. This is the first level. It's a really creative level. I like to I like to call it Bump from Super Monkey Ball 1. <laughs> no, seriously, it's it's just a retexture bump. Uh, this level this level is uh, made by Yoshi Master. It's really cool. I like the texture on it. And then there's this like really cool pipe like thing, which I still don't understand how to make. Uh, and you can just bounce like that. Grab the bananas and bounce on down. Uh, this level is pretty fun. So if you're interested in grabbing this uh, this ISO that has all these levels on it, I can put a Dropbox link in the uh, what you call it that's below the thing that people don't read. Uh, the description. Oh yeah, that's what those are. Forgot about those. I didn't actually forget about those. Now, let's hope I remember my way around this. Okay, I do. So this is supposed to be a remake of Chaos, but it's kind of small. Um, but still an interesting concept nonetheless. Uh, this was made by Never Gonna Give Us Up, I believe. Uh, so, interesting level. Uh, definitely, definitely, uh, you know, these are some of the first levels ever created for the game. So this level, it shows off that we can place two goals in here. Obviously, you got the green goal over there. You got your standard blue goal over here. Um, the texturing on this level is a little bit better. Um, the, the squares are a little bit too big for my taste, but, you know. All right, so this level, this level is made by Armac. This is a really, really cool level, uh, I think. Armac has some really cool concepts uh, concepts for his levels, so shout out. So you kind of, like, have to angle yourself here. Retry? Yeah. So you have to angle yourself to, like, get this clip, and then, oh, you want to get in there. You just want to get down. You want to you you get down, down. Get down, get down. Jungle Boogie. Which is kind of accurate because you're playing as monkeys and this is supposed to be the jungle world, but hey man. Don't let me rain on your parade. It's actually a lot harder than it than it looks, uh, and, and feels, and that's also what he said. Um So if oh, what the f What the fuck, dude? Okay. Ah! What the hell? <laughs> okay. Um, that was that was like less than spectacular. I did it again. I fucking I Britney Spears did. Oops, I did it again. Okay, pull back. God, I've never been this bad at this level. It's it's the streamer's curse, as they say, I guess, right? So. 
so far, custom level creation has come a long way in a very short amount of time. Um, you know, I figured out, we figured out how to, you know, add custom, uh, add custom sounds. There we, oh my god. Let's try this again. I'm gonna get it faster. Mute. Stronger. Maybe not. And we got, we can, you know, take the textures out of the game. We know how to do really cool custom textures. We can do custom music. Uh, we can make level packs, as you can see, you know, from this, this, uh, ISO here. Um, it's really cool. It's, it's really, really awesome. And it's just such a cool feeling to me to, like, be working on something, uh, that's, you know, at the very start of something monumental. It's a good feeling. This level's pretty cool. I like this. This is another one of, uh, our good friend, uh, it's our good friend Yoshi, Yoshi Master here with the interesting level. Uh, so essentially what you have to do is you have to like fall and then fall into the goal like that. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like the way that his levels look. I just think they're pretty neat. Um, personally, I hope he makes more. Uh, this is another Armac level. Um, I mean, it's a good stage. <laughs> uh, he already knows, Armac already knows that what I think of the textures on this level and all that, but other than the textures, I think this is a pretty great level. I don't know how I missed that. It's nice, it's short, it's simple, it looks cool. I say it's simple as I die. Uh, I probably deserve that. There we go. That's a cool level, though. Uh, this is another Armac level. This one's called Flower Petal. Now, you'll notice at the end, there's a little box that has a banana bush, uh, banana bushel in it. Um, and, and on this box right here, you have to clip off the top of the goal to get in that. And I've, I've never, I've never actually been able to do that. But essentially what you're supposed to do is, like, go down here and then you, like, clip off the goal. And it's silly and hard. <laughs> and I haven't done it, but if you do it, more power to you. All right, this level is made by uh, John Sheffrey, I believe, Sheffrey. And essentially it's a, uh, you, the, the bumpers are sideways and you have to hit the top of the bumpers. You gotta bounce in. It's uh, lol random XD pretty much, uh, if you get it or not, because it, it is actually kind of, it feels, it feels random. Feels like you're reading Tumblr, but you're not actually reading Tumblr. Uh, in fact, you're playing a video game, which is, in my opinion, a much better use of time, but. You know, that's neither here nor there. Uh, the last level in this set <laughs> is called Wind. It, it's my least favorite level, and you know, Jeff like, doesn't like the level Wind because it's a boring level, exclamation Wind in the chat. Um, no, this is this is like a remake of Wind, but without the shoulders, so you actually have a chance of actually falling off, and the camera almost fucked me there. Last time I almost got fucked that hard, yeah, I was like 19 or something. Anyway, that is World 1 uh, redone. There's a cutscene. Yay, cutscenes. Um, next time I'll show you some more levels that are randomly sp like spread out in uh, in Monkey Ball 2. Uh, but thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a video, leave the video a like. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, thanks for watching, and I will we'll see you guys next time for more Monkey Ball Maker. Um, if there's anything you'd like me to show you from Monkey Ball Maker, uh, as far as if there's any specific levels that you might want to see designed, if there's any uh, specific like tutorials you want me to go over, if there's any uh, if there's anything at all, whether like whatever content-wise that you want to see from this series, let me know in the comments. Give me some feedback. I love I love hearing from you guys in the comments. I love hearing from you guys. You know, your feedback means a lot to me. So if you have feedback for me, I'd appreciate it. Um, and thank you guys so much for supporting uh, the series, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, y'all.